Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today we're addressing a frustrating issue that many developers encounter after updating their packages. Our viewer has run into a problem with loading a specific assembly after upgrading to Microsoft.Entity Framework Core.SchoolServer version 1.1.2. Let's dive into the details of this error and explore how we can resolve it together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. The error you're encountering indicates that the assembly Microsoft.Extensions.Dependency Injection Abstractions cannot be loaded. This often happens due to version mismatches after updating packages. First, let's check your project references. Ensure that all related packages are updated to compatible versions. You can do this by using the NuGet Package Manager in Visual Studio. Next, verify that your project is referencing the correct version of Microsoft.Extensions.DependencyInjection.Abstractions. You can do this by checking your .csproj file for the specific version. If the version is correct, try cleaning and rebuilding your solution. This can resolve issues related to cached assemblies. Finally, if the issue persists, consider reinstalling the problematic package. Use the command update package Microsoft.extensions dependency injection.abstractions in the package manager console. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. A user encountered a similar issue with Azure Functions version 3.0.13, receiving a file not found error for Microsoft.Extensions.Options version 6.0.0. They resolved it by adding a direct reference to the package via NuGet and modifying their project file. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the issue with loading the assembly, the user recommends downgrading all .NET standard packages to version, to version 2.2.0. They believe that the 3.x packages are meant for a different .NET standard version that isn't compatible with .NET framework. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. This user encountered an issue with loading the Microsoft.Extensions.DependencyInjection.Abstractions assembly. They found that installing the Microsoft.Extensions.Primitives package in both their main project and test project resolved the problem. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the issue with loading the assembly, the user recommends updating all Microsoft packages after upgrading to .NET 4.7.2. Then, they suggest cleaning and rebuilding the solution.
Let's now look at another user suggested answer. If the solution from Luis Gouveia doesn't resolve your issue, consider downgrading other dependencies in your project. This is due to compatibility problems with .NET standard. For more details, you can refer to the GitHub issue linked in the description. And that's it guys. We've gone through, found the solutions, and hopefully answered your query. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, hope you have a good one. Cheers.